Hello everyone, so this is Anno and I am from IIT Hyderabad. Uh, I am Raja's elder sister. So actually uh, today in this video I will let you know about the PMR fellowship. Like how you can get a PMR fellowship. And uh, so let's start this video. So actually if you are a PhD student in India, then you must be aware of PMR fellowship. And uh, since it, it stands for Prime Minister Research Fellowship, and uh, it is very, it is one of the prestigious fellowship in India, especially for the PhD scholars. So those who, uh, who wants to do PhD in India, uh, this can be a big motivation like me. I also wanted to have this fellowship. Like it, doing PhD in India is a, a very, um, very rare choice the people prefer uh, because they think like uh, uh, mas up to master's the uh, education in India is fine, but for PhD, uh, it's uh, the PhD uh, from uh, from foreign universities uh, will be will be better than this uh, Indian university, and this is true up to some extent. Uh, I will uh, talk about these things uh, in another video, but let us not talk about the PMR fellowship. That how you can apply, what are the eligibility criteria, uh, what are the chances that you will get, uh, uh, you will, uh, that, that prefers that you will get. So, let us talk one by one. So, specifically, there are two modes of applying in PMR fellowship. First one is the direct one and second one is the lateral one. So, in the direct one, those who have not been admitted in the PhD program, they are eligible to apply. Like if they are from uh, normal universities, central universities and uh, IITs, IITs, then you, they can apply in one of the PMR granting institute and they can avail this fellowship through the, through the application process. So actually the PMR fellowships uh, rolling positions come uh, twice in a year and uh, so from there you can apply. The date, This one is for the direct entry one. And second one is the lateral entry one. Lateral entry one, PhD scholars are more preferred to get uh, PhD, PMR fellowships. This is because they know how to write a research proposal and they know their area of research as well. So in the lateral entry, PhD scholars, those who are admitted in all the IITs, uh, uh, some NITs like NIT Trichy, uh, uh, all uh, IISERs and obviously IASC Bangalore so SERs and obviously IASC Bangalore so so those who are in uh, these institute they can apply so they know how to apply also but those who don't know I'll let you know so how to apply the application positions come and you have to apply uh, through that that uh, and if you are from the later entry then the things matter like it you you sh should be appointed from your institute level then you can apply for the national level so for the institute level also some screening process is there like you have to uh, uh, upload your PMRF fellowship uh, application uh, research proposal uh, your uh, academic records your publication records your internship details training details all these stuffs so they'll screen uh, on the basis of the applications um, at the institute level, then they will take forward to the national level. So this process goes on everywhere. And the national panel, uh, the national committee will select you according to the eligibility criteria and according to some, some points is there, like academic records, uh, publication records, uh, and uh, your uh, B.Tech CGPA, your um, Tech CGPA, your uh, PhD CGPA, these all matters. So your more specifically research proposal, which matters a lot. So you want to know how to write a proper research proposal, then please comment in this channel. Please do subscribe this channel and please reach out in this channel and stay tuned in this channel. Uh, actually, this is the channel of my brother. He is my younger brother. And he he itself has secured many fellowship, so I'll I'll let you know about this. So in this video, 
uh, i think this is this information is fine and uh, in another videos uh, i will cover how to write a research proposal how to how to properly apply how to get a recommendation letter what 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 percentage of these things matter what are the chances that you will get a fellowship so these are the things and if you try you can it's not a big deal so stay tuned